won't mince words with you, Dennis. I want that viper, and you have to get it. I guess we're not in it anymore. You've been well compensated for your efforts. If it wasn't for me, you'd be hustling $20 drag races in San Francisco to pay your rent. Now, to do this, you've got to beat Hale straight up. A tall order. Did it once. In a drag event, Dennis, the next one will be a nav challenge, which is perfectly suited for Hale's spontaneous style. As a former car thief, he's used to making quick decisions. Plus, he knows just about every major city like the back of his hand, because he's worked them all. Quite a pep talk. But he's a bit full of himself. He'll underestimate you, and that will be his downfall. For now, try to take your mind off things. Go out, have a night on the town. You can sleep late tomorrow. Well, Black, I have to say I respect you, but I'm done playing with you. Buckle up, it's gonna be a rough ride. <laughs> I'll tell you what, after I'm done with you, I'll give you a job. I can always use a good mechanic. A man without a car don't need a mechanic.
Damn, damn, damn! I don't believe it! You have proven yourself right. Hale will give you his gift, and Clark will inform you about the next step. You'd better enjoy Eileen while you have her, because I may have to repossess her at some point in the future. You mean I should enjoy her, and I assure you you won't be getting her back. We'll see about that, Donnie. I'll turn her over to your boy. Wonderful effort. Simply spectacular, Dennis.